Petrus Vonskret is one of the apartheid's security branch policemen who interrogated Dr. Neil Agate in February 1982. Days later, Agate was found hanging in his cell in John Foster Square. He also testified in the first inquest, which ruled Agate's death a suicide. During cross-examination, the lawyer for the Agate family challenged his evidence. Howard Varney says the four-page statement in which Agate allegedly implicated his comrades in illegal activities is a security branch fabrication meant to cover up their role in his death. Von Schreit says he found no incriminating evidence when he interrogated Agate. Varney also cross-examined Von Schreit that he left the interrogation to attend a function. This was never mentioned in the initial evidence. Mr. Wonsrecht, why do you have such difficulty in answering a simple question? The question was not whether you might have been seen by other officers. That's not the question. You've given that evidence. We have moved on. The question is, as a police officer in the South African police, if you were absent from an interrogation that you should have been at, were you not duty-bound to bring that to the attention of the court? Lord, I disagree. There's not a definite um, duty on me to disclose that I went to the toilet or I made coffee or I attended. Um, my Lord, I disagree. There's not a definite um, duty on me to disclose that I went to the toilet or I made coffee or I attended a function. Um, those things should have come out um, in the cross-examination and if uh, Advocate Bezos asked me about it, I would have um, mentioned these things, um, yes. Von Schreit is adamant he did not mislead the 1982 inquiry or this one. I didn't try to mislead the court, not at the front end. Well, Mr. Wunsrecht, it'll be up to um, this Honourable Court to make a determination on, on that question. The inquiry will resume on Monday. Hasina Gori, SABC News, Johannesburg.